Why was Avram afraid? In Pashat Lech Lecha, we're told how Hashem appeared to Avram in a vision at night in order to reassure him. Hashem said, Al tira Avram, Anochi magen lach. Do not fear Avram. I will shield and protect you. At this very moment, Avram was riding high. He had just been victorious in the war between the four kings and the five kings. He had managed to rescue Lot from captivity. Everything in his life was going well. And Davka, at this point, Hashem needed to reassure him. Rashi explains that Avram feared that he had used up all of his credit, that as a reward for all of his righteousness and his good deeds, Hashem had blessed him in battle, but if he would be attacked again, oh, then he could be in trouble. There is a Midrash with a different parish. The Midrash tells us that after this war, there were many people licking their wounds and Avram feared a reprisal because after every conflict, there are pieces to be picked up. But I'd like to suggest a different explanation. It's from the world of football. Often you would find a match in which the two sides are really attacking one another, desperate to score the first goal. And after a long time, eventually one team scores and then within a few minutes, the opposing team scores and it's one all. You see, that's what happens in life when we are victorious, when we're doing well, when we're successful, suddenly we become vulnerable because we have a false sense of confidence. And that's what Avram feared. Now that indeed he was doing so well, perhaps he could be lulled into that sense of confidence. Perhaps he wouldn't govern as hard as he used to. Or perhaps he wouldn't be as conscious of what was going on around him. And therefore Hashem reassured him, don't worry. Even though you might perceive that you're a bit vulnerable, I will protect you. From here I believe there are some very strong messages which emerge for us. Even when things are going well in our lives, let's not presume that that's always the way that they're going to be. We should always be vigilant. Let's always guarantee that when it comes to praying, we should daven both in times when there is danger and also in times of blessing. We constantly need Hashem to protect us. Three times a day, we recall in our prayers, the promise of Hashem to Avram when he said, Anuchi lach, I will shield you when we say the words, Baruch atah Hashem, blessed are you Hashem, Magain Avraham, the shield of Avraham. And with this sentiment, our prayer is, may the Almighty bless and protect us, both in times of trouble and also when things are going well. Shabbat Shalom.